Hello, my foodie mortal souls. If you love corn on the cob as much as I do, you might be asking yourself, how long should I boil it to have the perfect corn on the cob? Well, I found an answer for us. Chefs say we have to boil it for four to five minutes um, in a pot that's about halfway full of water and brought to boil over a medium high heat. Once it's boiled, we can add seasonings, the butter, the works. You know what we do. But I have some extra tips for you. You can also add flavors to the water that you're boiling the corn in. If you've never tried it, um, they say anything aromatic to boost the flavor can be done. Of course, people add salt to water. You can have lemons and give a couple of shakes of Old Bay seafood seasoning. Um, and some people even use a splash of white wine, bay leaves, or smashed garlic cloves in the water where they're boiling the corn. So these are wonderful options to try. And I've decided, since it's four to five minutes, I'm going to give you a four and a half minute timer. That way when you hear the timer go off, if you're not in the room, it'll still be closer to five minutes by the time you go and turn off and move that corn. So here we go. Your four and a half minute timer is going to start right now.
That's time. That's four and a half minutes, M. Soul. Your corn on the cob should be perfectly boiled. Go on. Go get it out of the water with some tongs to put on a serving plate and serve it warm. Now make sure you cool it down just a little. Remember to butter it and season with salt or anything else you like to use. Sometimes I even use a little bit of paprika or turmeric. Um, but it's all up to you to each their own. Bon appetit, M. Soul.